The council is bankrupt and under administration, still is overstaffed, and there's no change to the situation. And this is what is happening to your taxes and rates. It's time to streamline government, abolish councils and the states. The truth is councils overstaffed, and this is not a joke. Too many layers of bureaucracy mean this council's going broke. Good. Yeah. Thank you very much. Um, yeah, and that's actually like all based on a true story, according to Carolyn Hunter. Yeah, she she did. She stuffed the tire. She had that experience with the dude when he was painting holes, and she asked him, and she went into the council chambers, and they voted and fixed the tires, and they didn't piss the pot off. Gosh. I know. I know. <laughs> Meanwhile, in Australia. Make a slush fund for the, for the tyres, you know. Oh, they do. It's like they have a slush fund for, for lawnmowers that, that throw stones and break windows. You ever get a stone chip, you just like drive past the council lawnmower man and then you go and call the council and say, oh, he broke my window with his lawnmower and I paid for it. <laughs> Don't tell everyone that or everyone will be doing it. Go on. <laughs> You've got a chip, haven't you? Didn't that happen when you went past that like local council dude out there, like on the lawnmower? Yeah, yeah I'm sure I saw that stone. <laughs> 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 yeah, I heard it too. Yeah. yeah. So, yeah. plenty of witnesses. Nearly whisked past my eyes. <laughs>